Without women, the revolution is nothing. That's right. Let me say that again. Without women, the revolution is nothing. I'm not a quick dog. <laughs> my name is Larry Dorsey Jr. I'm representing the indigenous people of Colombia. And this is my god brother right here, Guacamo, representing the Hopi Nation. And thanks to my fellow Colombian Equipto, we helped raise over $4,000 to take out the Standing Rock. And it was one of the most spiritual experiences of my life, of our lives. It was, it was, out, it was so crazy. It was so beautiful to help those people, to bring those supplies out. This is, he also came out with us, this is Rob, he's, he's representing the Lakota Nation right here. You know, black and brown unity right here, you know, we, we have, you know, so it's much love. And um, on the way out there, with all the, a, car, a truck full of supplies, on the way out there, we got pulled over. We got, and um, they were pulling people over and accosting them and taking their supplies. And, and we got pulled over for no reason by a big old cowboy. About 6'4", white dude, and there was, he had no reason to pull us over. Luckily, it was during Thanksgiving. So I told him, he, he immediately said, step out the car. And I was just like, oh, and he was all like, come back to me, come back with me to my car. And I sat in the car with him. It was the strangest experience. And he's, oh, he's overlooking me the whole time. And he asked me, what am I doing with California plates in a car full of, uh, uh, packed to the brim with, with all types of supplies? And I told him, Oh, we're part of a church retreat, and we're bringing donations for Thanksgiving. <laughs> <You know? laughs> and he believed me, and he let me go. It was, it was, it was amazing. <laughs> and at a lot of the protests, we experienced a lot of racism, you know? And they would ride by in their trucks with signs saying, like, uh, white power and all that. And they would go, go back to where you came from. And all the natives were like, this is where we're from. <laughs> So, you know, I would just like to give a shout out personally to Urban Native Era. They're, cover, they're making covers. It's an indigenous, you know, brand. And also, uh, Aim West and, and uh, The Last Real Indians. Check those out. Also, if you want to support, you can also check out Sean King's Injustice Boycott. Because he's, he's supporting Stan Rock, you know, and supporting San Francisco. And um, before I get off the stage and the crypto comes up here and rocks the mic, I'd just like to do a little call and response. So, I'm going to say Black Snake Killers. I want you guys to say it back. Black Snake Killers! 